Hey everyone, Lego Stop Motion here, and this is another Lego Minecraft 2017 set review, and this is the Jungle Temple. Um, the set is set 21132, the Jungle Temple, 598 pieces, and it's just, um, uh, just a building toy. Lego, the best brick brand, cough cough, Mega Block sucks, and um. Yeah, so the, fi the figures, we got Steve in full leather armor. Now that's new, and I think that is pretty cool. Um, we got an Ocelot, um, I've seen that before. I have a few of those now. Um, I got two skeletons in the set too. Skeletons are pretty basic, but it's always nice to have more. This is the Jungle Temple, really cool set. Um, we go in the back of the box here. Um, okay, let's see, we got Steve running toward the skeletons, which the skeletons are guarding the temple. He's just carrying a cocoa pod with the ocelot looking at him. He's walking into the temple. Looks like he's about to be hit by that arrow, but he's dodging it. You flip the switches to open the chest so you can get all the goodies inside. And you can always just build, change to new models. So, let's see what's inside the box. Wow, you don't need this anymore. Ah, uh, stop. Stop throwing that box behind you. Sorry. Let's see what bags we got. We got two of these 16 by 16 dark bluish gray plates. We got, oh, so they're pretty cool bag. We got bag one. Bag two. Bag four, bag three. Okay, I'm just gonna take a look at bag one, see what it has. Okay, awesome. Okay, let's get building. Okay, I'm done building the set. Um, before I show you guys the actual temple, I'm gonna show you guys the four minifigures included in the set. Now, let's start here with Steve. He has the new leather armor, which I think is pretty cool. He even has the new orangish brown, I think that's what color it is, pants with the new armor, which is leather, and just has an ordinary iron sword. Um, no printing on the back of this character if we just take off the chest piece. Um, there we go, we got a bit of a smudge misprint on this thing, this character, and he just has one little print on the torso there and nothing on the back. It's a pretty basic minifigure. Um, this set included two skeletons. Um, here they are, very basic skeleton with the cool bow on there. Something that they have to do in LEGO Minecraft is add the enchanted bow. Not in the skeleton, but an enchanted bow. I think that'd be pretty cool. Just a normal boxy head, um, normal skeleton body with the new pixelated bow. Not really new, it's released in the first wave. Okay, last character, the Ocelot. You won't believe how much Ocelots I have now. I got one baby Ocelot custom and three adult Ocelots. So here, the Oc this is the Ocelot. I love cats, so this is a perfect character for me. So, it's a normal ocelot prints and same design as before. Okay, now that we're done reviewing the four minifigures include the set, let's put them onto the actual jungle temple. So I think I'm gonna put Steve, he's gonna be after the skeletons. So I'm gonna go here, right into the temple, put one skeleton here, the other skeleton getting ready to fire at Steve here. And I'm gonna put the ocelot on the tree right there. Perfect minifigure poses. This set is a perfect set. So here's just the whole set itself on the outside. Surprisingly, this is a set without holes in the back. Like there's little things there, but that's to take the whole top off, which I'm gonna show you guys pretty soon. Includes one jungle tree, which helps my stash of jungle trees. Let's see, how much jungle trees do I have? This is like my seventh or eighth jungle tree, so 
quite a few trees and pretty good for my jungle display in my Lego Minecraft world. Okay, um, so on the back, there's this little thing there that's for the one of the contraptions in the back. We also have this for another contraption in the back. It looks like it's mossy brick. And then here's just another spin of the set. Okay, let's see the inside. So the roof of this thing um, comes off very easily. You just pull this off right there, and then you get to look at the temple in the inside. It has the levers there, or the switches, and we got the firing arrow, which was that contraption we can see on the back. Knocked over. So we go to this side where we can see the really cool, it's like the best contraption Lego has ever made. So there's these switches, um, I think this is the way you do it in the game. You flip them, and if you get them the right way... It'll open with a nice chest with goodies inside. So we got one diamond, one emerald, and a bone, but it comes with extras of all those pieces. Which I think is pretty cool. So we're just gonna close that chest, close this up, lock it up so Steve cannot get inside. <laughs> so we go over here to the outside of the set. Got a nice entrance there. The cool thing is when you put the roof on, or the top on, that back on. All of these things are modular. You can take all of these off, this off, like all these little things, even the front, and even these things in the sides of the set. And I think that's pretty cool, pretty creative, and it's a good way to make this look different if you want to be a player made structure, or if you think this doesn't look accurate, but I think this looks accurate. This is definitely going into my display. Okay guys, time to end the review of the Jungle Temple set. I hope you and guys enjoyed this video. I enjoyed building the set and I enjoyed getting the set. It's quite a bit of money, but pretty good for the parts. Comes with a lot of parts because of all the tiny little vine details and the moss details, but it's a pretty good set. It took me a while to build but it is still a great set. I, re I recommend you guys getting it. And yeah. So guys, don't forget to like, subscribe, and more. Do, do, do. Oh my gosh, a skeleton. A jungle temple. Are you trying to get into my temple? Um, nope. Ah! Ha, I am too tough with this leather armor. Ha <laughs> ha. Wait, what is that? Ah.